Hi, I'm Rishwari, and welcome to another video. And in this video, we're going to uh, talk about uh, NASA's Rocketdyne F1 engine, and I'll be using animated videos. So let's get started. Hi, I'm Phoenix. I will teach you topics with animated videos. So let's get started. In this video, we'll learn about NASA's F1 engine problem. In June 1962, uh, NASA was ready to perform a test of the engine. But unfortunately, as the engine ignited, uh, the engine uh, exploded. It took many uh, tests which also exploded. At last, when the engineers uh, finally found what was going wrong. This was caused due to combustion instability, which means the propellants in the combustion chamber burn unevenly and cause a lot of pressure swings inside the chamber as the fuel injects unevenly which moves the flame around in the combustion chamber and these pressure swings were happening 2000 times a second which was enough to completely uh, explode the engine and the solution to this problem wasn't going to be apparent engineers focused on the injector plate uh, which inject injects the uh, uh, fuel and the oxidizer into into the combustion chamber. The first design was a single large plate with uh, multiple holes. To solve this issue, uh, engineers uh, uh, looked at the first uh, rocket engine, uh, rocket designs which were ever uh, developed, the V2. The, v the V2 engines had different uh, nozzles which separated the combustion into different uh, streams. The engineers split up the plate into many smaller sections. After experimenting with many designs, the engineer came up with a solution which stabilized the combustion chamber. And the design was uh, put up to a test and the engine success the test. But many worried that uh, the once the engine was in uh, flight, the vibrations could uh, uh, bring back pressure swings so to test uh, this uh, design uh, they used an unusual method nasa placed a small bomb in the center of the combustion chamber and as soon as the engine fired up the uh, bomb would uh, bur uh, burst which would uh, re replace the uh, vibrations while the engine was in flight and the flame inside the engine became uh, completely unstable but the new design of the injector plate uh, resolved the problem. NASA performed many uh, tests uh, to make sure that this engine is safe for the astronauts. And that's a very interesting way that uh, they tested the engine. Thank you and see you in the next video.